Hi guys, today we are going to discuss the past perfect tense. Today we will discuss past perfect tense. Discuss karenge. And uh, if you are new to my channel, first of all subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for my new videos. Today I am going to teach you the past perfect tense, how do we use it in the sentences. Okay, past perfect tense ko hum urdu mein fail mazi mukamal kehte hain. Past perfect tense ko hum urdu mein fail mazi mukamal kehte hain. This tense is used for all those actions which started in the past and completed in the past. Is tense ko hum mazi ke un arkaat ke liye istemal karte hain jo mazi mein shuru huye aur mazi mein khatam bhi ho gaye. Got it? So we have four major points. The first major point we have that is identification. Pehla major point humare paas kya hai? Identification hai. Got it? We call it in Urdu pehchan. Yaad rakhna hai jab bhi kisi Urdu jumle ke akhir mein chuka tha, chuki thi ya chuke the aaj hai. Iska matlab that sentence belongs to past perfect tense. Keep in your mind, if any Urdu sentence ends with any of these letters, that sentence belongs to past perfect tense. The next is verb. Okay, we use third form of the verb as a verb in the past perfect tense. We have three perfect tenses, present perfect tense, past perfect tense and future perfect tense. In all these three tenses, we use third form of the verb. The next is helping verb. Hamare paas ek hi helping verb hai is tense mein that is had. We had two in the present. Present mein hamare paas have and has tha. Lekin yaha par hamare paas sirf aur sirf ek helping verb hai that is had. Got it? And it is used with all the subjective cases. Whether that is I, we, you, they, he, she, it with all nouns and pronouns. Got it? Then we have simple formula. Subject plus helping verb plus third form plus subject plus Full stop. Got it? Now we have the sentence Wo bazaar ja chuke te. Now the sentence ends with chuke te. It means that sentence belongs to past perfect tense. Got it? So they, with they we use the helping verb. They ke saath hum helping verb had istimal karte hai. They had gone to school. Wo school ja chuke te. Got it? Wo school ja chuke te. The next sentence is Hum waha mil chuke te. Hum waha Mil chuke te. This also ends with chuke te. It means the sentence belongs to past perfect tense. Got it? We had met there. We had met there. Subject, helping verb, third form of the verb, then the object. Got it? Then we have negative sentences. Got it? In negative sentences, negative mein hum kya karte hai? Had ke baad sirf not lagate hai. Yaha par had hai, iske baad not lagai. Yaha par bhi had, iske baad bhi. Aap not lagao ge, to aapka sentence negative ban jai ga. They had not gone to school. We had not met there. Wo bazaar nahi ja chuke te. Hum unse nahi mil chuke te. Got it? Next is interrogative sentences. Aakhri hama mein hamaare paas hai. Sawaliya jumle. Interrogative sentences begins with helping verb. Ends with question mark. How had they gone to school? Kya wo bazaar ja chuke te? Had we met there? Kya hum waha mil chuke te? Till then, then take care. Allah Hafiz.